Kutai Martadipura is a Hindu kingdom in the archipelago as the oldest historical kingdom in Indonesia. It was established in the 4th century. This kingdom was located in Muara Kaman subdistrict of Kutai Kartanagara Regency in the upper Makam River, East Kalimantan Province. The name Kutai was given by the experts taken from the name with the discovery of an inscription that shows the existence of the kingdom. One of these inscriptions, or Yupa, it was known that the greatest king who ruled the kingdom of Kutai Martadipura at that time was Mulawarman. And then Mulawarman became the name of the army's district common unit. Mulawarman Museum and the name of the largest university in Borneo, namely Mulawarman University. The Samarinda city has an area of 718 square kilometers with a population of almost 1 million people which make this city become the largest population in East Kalimantan. Mulawarman University is located in Samarinda, the capital city of East Kalimantan province, which is the center of government and trade that cleave by the Mahakam River. The river is the main gateway to the interior of East Kalimantan. Based on the decision of the governor as the head of the first labor region of East Kalimantan province on 7th June 1962, a university named Mulawarman University was established. The Mulawarman Territory Education was set at the university in East Kalimantan based on the decision of the Minister of Higher Education and Science Toyip Hadi Wijaya on 28 September 1962. But the name was then returned to Mulawarman University and officially confirmed by the President of the Republic of Indonesia, Sukarno, on 23 April 1963. The 27th of September 1962 was set as the date of Mulawarman University establishment based on the decree of Minister of Higher Education and Science number 130 on 1962. Mulawarman University as International Standard University which has significant role in terms of nation development through education, research and public service that focus on natural resources, especially in tropical rainforest. The principal scientific orientation of Mulawarman University is the humid tropical forest, which become the vision of Mulawarman University. Initially, Mulawarman has four faculties of constitutional and economic faculty, faculty of agriculture, Faculty of Forestry and Mining Faculty. In its development today, Mulawarman University has 14 faculties of several postgraduates with a total of college students of 40,000 people consisting of 35,000 undergraduate students and 5,000 postgraduate students. Educational Mulawarman University consists of Faculty of Economic and Business Faculty of Social and Political Sciences Faculty of Agriculture Faculty of Forestry Faculty of Education Faculty of Fisheries and Marine Sciences Faculty of Science 
Faculty of Law Faculty of Engineering Faculty of Medicine Faculty of Public Health Faculty of Pharmacy Faculty of Cultural Sciences and Faculty of Computer and Information Technology In carrying out its research and community service functions, Mulawarman University has research and community service institution consisting of research centers such as the Center for Environmental and Natural Resource Research, Research Center for Regional Development and Public Policy, Gender Equality Research Center and Child Protection, Research Center for Drugs and Public Health, Center for Strengthening Community Empowerment Institution, Center for Publications and Scientific Research and Hockey or Intellectual Property Rights and Geospatial Infrastructure and Information Development Center. For the academic affairs, we have four priority programs. First is to revitalize the scientific orientation of the Mulawarman University. Second is to improve the quality of teaching and learning processes. The third is to increase professionality of academic, technical, and functional staff. And the last is to improve accreditation of study programs. In technical service at the university, there are several technical implementation units. There are Central Library, Language Center, International Service, Information and Communication Technology, Archives, Biological Resources Laboratory, and Technical Implementation Unit of Career Development and Entrepreneurship. The human resources of Mulawarman University are highly qualified with over 1,000 lecturers who are alumni from high-quality universities in Indonesia and abroad. Lecturers' qualification improvement program continues to be upgraded to reach 75% of qualified doctor by 2019. Mulawarman University has four campuses. The main campus is in Gunung Kulwa and the three other campuses are in Flores Campus, Pahlawan Campus, and Bangris Campus. Besides the campuses, Unmul also has forest of educational forest in Bukit Suharto, agricultural garden in Teluk Dalam, and Unmul Botanical Garden in Samarinda. I'm Abdul Nur, Espice Director Mulawarman University for Resources, Administration and Finance Affairs. We have responsibility to increase the general administrative services and financial management program by giving on assessment of Mulawarman University financial opinion in 2015, 2016 and the next year, the later insha'Allah in 2000. 18. Thank you. Mulawarman University students have a variety of extracurricular activities incorporated in the Student Executive Board, Students' Activity Units, BAM Faculty, Students' Associations of Majors, and other various activities. Student programs are expected could develop interest in students' talents and abilities as soft skills for applying in the community life. We always strive to improve the role and achievement of Mulawarman University students, both nationally and internationally, even to go towards Mulawarman University to become an international university. Grand design of Mulawarman University strategic plan has been designed until 2034 and it's expected could be a world-class university with 80% of study programs holding an A accreditation and 95% of lecturers having doctor qualification. At that 
time, Mulawarman University has become a center of excellence for tropical study with standard research infrastructure facilities. In the future, uh, for a long time, uh, we have met a green design of Mulawarman University with the expectation that uh, all key performance indicators are above the national average. Therefore, cooperation of all internal and external parties are highly expected. Mulawarman University cooperation relationships have been established with various government and private agencies, both national and overseas countries. The cooperation may include academic cooperation, research, institutional review, and community training. Until now, the number of Mulawarman University partners have reached 197 cooperations, include 21 overseas cooperations. I am Ubay. I came from Syria. Uh, Unmul University is the best. Unmul is awesome! Hi, I am Mubarak from Sudan. Mulawarman University is good. Let's make Mulawarman University SD Center of Excellence for Tropical Studies.